All right, you guys, so I'm working on a bit of a project. So I don't know if you guys have seen uh, these things called bait phones or shock phones or whatever you want to call them. Um, yeah, I'm trying to make one of those, right? So I have a dog collar and everything. I took it all apart, took a phone apart. I'm trying to fit it inside of the phone, right? Then figure out all this stuff to make it work. Well, it's like extremely freaking hard to do because the component that, like the shock part, like the shock battery and all that stuff is so big that it's like hard to fit inside of the back of the phone. So I'm having like the biggest problem with that. And for some reason I cannot find the charger for it anywhere. So we're about to go to Walmart, Radio Shack, check some places out and see if we can find a charger for it. That's what I was talking about. I have the remote for the dog collar, the shock collar that I used in a previous video. And as you can see, it works and everything. So dog collar work, shock collar, remote thingy works. This is the inside of the shock collar. These are the prongs that went out. And then this is like the other piece, the battery, the charging port right there. And right here's the reset button. So you could push that. You could probably hear it pushing, clicking. That's the reset button. And so basically that's all I have right now. And then this is the phone I gutted out kind of. It's an old Galaxy thingy or Samsung, whatever, I don't know. So I took it all apart, kind of shaved some out right here to try to make it feel a little bit better. And so basically it's still not fitting yet. As you can see, it's obviously bulging out quite a bit. So I'm still working on it, trying to figure out everything, but I need a charger because I cannot find the charger that goes to it. So I got to fix that. So this is the back. It goes over, you know, if it's fine. In this bag here, I got the buttons and screws to screw on the back and some stuff. Then I got this little, like, little metal plate tree thingy. Because I was thinking I, if it doesn't work through the phone, I could probably put this on like the back of the case somehow and paint it black or something to where these and cut a hole to where these will be poking out, touch this, and then this will shock and it still works. So I don't know. So we'll have to see how it goes. Uh, yeah, so that's just what I got so far on it. Okay guys, so that is basically what I have on the shock phone, bait phone. That's all I have on it right now. So what I'm going to do is work on that more, you know, try to get it all fixed out, get all the problems fixed, find a charger, figure all that stuff out. And so, but Thursday, we're leaving to go to Ohio. So that's gonna be awesome. We'll be down there for the weekend, then we're coming back. And then we'll be going down for spring break, Easter break, whatever you want to call it, to have some more fun down there. We'll be making videos with some old friends, you know, having a bunch of fun. So, uh, yeah, look for so yeah, look forward to that. Uh, I got a request to go to an abandoned building to explore it or like a haunted place or do an overnight challenge or something like that. Um, I've been trying to get a few people to go for an overnight challenge because I feel like it'd be boring just me. And I'm out of, and I'm blurry. Let me let me fix that. Okay, so I've been trying to get a few people to go with me to do the overnight challenge, and no one's really able to. So, and I like if no one was to go with me, it'd be just me, and I feel like that'd be kind of boring, and not so entertaining. Definitely boring for me because I'd be the only person. But you know what I mean, like, how much fun is that? Just just you alone, like that's that's really boring. So, uh, I'm trying to get a few people to do that. Uh, eventually it will happen if I even if I do have to do it alone I will but I'd rather have some people to go with me it'd be a much more fun so that is coming up uh, I do have an abandoned, abandoned building that I had been looking at I was going to do a video there but uh, I haven't got around to it yet so that is coming up soon so look forward to that also and uh, yeah that's gonna end this video uh, um, if you like the video make sure to smash the thumbs up button subscribe if you're new join the AOS family and uh, comment anything you guys have, like, comment any video ideas, what you guys thought of the video, you know, let me know uh, in the comments down below. See you guys later.